it's rare to have somebody who, a kid who's so focused on what it is he wants. And I think that that's where, what separates John from just about everybody else is that he, you know, going into this year, you know, told me this is what I want to do. I want to, I want to fly fighter jets or airplanes and, and this is what I'm doing ultimately to get to that goal. If every student in the world was like him, there wouldn't be a teacher shortage. Judge was the perfect place for me to, you know, achieve this goal. Um, originally, I didn't think I was going to get an all five because it's a very challenging process, very low acceptance rate, with the Needle Academy being 8% acceptance rate going up to, um, I think it's like 18 for Coast Guard. So from that range, I got accepted in all five academies. And that really helped me um, realize that I couldn't have achieved this um, at any other school. Judge really allowed me to do it. And when I was re started receiving those appointments, it was one of the most gratifying things that um, I've ever uh, felt. I'm proud of him because he's worked his whole life, he wanted his whole life, he wanted to fly. Ever since he was little, even before I can remember, he wanted to fly. I see him as a leader, and he is a good leader. He's strong, he's confident, he's always open to listening to everybody, and he's just, just a good person in general. He's constantly wanting to improve. I've seen him at practice, and he wants his teammates to improve too, so even with his younger brother, who's also on the cross country and track team, he's, I've seen him, you know, hug him at the end of a race, and he's just, he's a very supportive and encouraging person in general, so. I saw how hard he worked for it. I know that he really wanted it, it was very important to him, it was all he talked about, and I saw that his journey there actually started extremely early, earlier than all of us going to regular college, so I saw not only how much it meant to him, but how hard he worked for it, and the hard work he put in ended up paying off, so I'm proud of him for doing that. He came in and as a freshman, and he knew in his heart that he always talked about flying, and he did place in the honors classes. So I feel like his four years, he has just, every year, he's just been challenged. Judge encouraged that. You know, they, look, I need, you know, I want to register for this class. And, and I said it, it just doesn't get handed to anybody either. You have to show the effort. And he worked hard, and, and he achieved that. A judge laid the groundwork for him to be able to do that, you know, and, and by challenging them, and they gave them challenging classes, and, you know, they make you a better student, they make you a better person. The meaning of life is to find your gifts, and the purpose of life is to give them away. The idea of being who you are and being that well is finding who you are, finding where your talents are, finding your strengths, finding your passions, and running with it. Father Judge offers a really unique educational program. Unlike many places, we don't pigeonhole our kids into one path when they get here or have a self-determined way in which they're going to get their education. It's not just about the classroom, it's about the student as a whole and making them, you know, be who they are perfectly well. Really, it's not the price tag that you pay, but the investment that the faculty and the administration have in making sure the students are successful. And that has a lot to do with what Father Judge is and what we stand for. And I think that's really what separates us from these other schools, is our ability to continually offer whatever a student feels they need and whatever we feel a student needs for them to be successful and go and do whatever it is they want to do. John's following in the footsteps of a school that is proud of its service. Uh, and there's many military veterans in the 27, and so I think when you think about this accomplishment singularly, it's great for John, but I think for all those Judge Crusaders who've come before him and for those considering Father Judge and elsewhere, I think it speaks to, uh, it's not about the price tag one pays, it's about their determination and how much they put into the institution and their level of engagement and involvement, and clearly John uh, has taken full credit of that as a student athlete, uh, as one honed in on his academics, and one who's been committed to the principles and the Salesian values of Father Judge, and so we wish him well as he moves forward.